I'm... I'm sorry. Not as sorry as you will be, my boy. I didn't mean... Your love for that tramp, Eve Russell, has cost you dearly. Oh, my God, what happened? What's happened? What's going on here? Ask Julian. He's going to suffer the consequences of this grave error for a long time to come. We'll talk about it later, Eve. Julian, your father is bleeding. Let me take a look at that. Don't touch me! Alistair, it looks like a deep cut. You might need stitches. If I need stitches, I'll go to a real doctor. Not some drugged-out slut masquerading as a doctor. That's enough, Father. Oh, come, come, Julian. We both know what she is. If it weren't for me, she wouldn't have an M.D. after her name at all. She'd still be singing in some nightclub, strung out and turning tricks to get her next fix. Turning tricks? That's a lie, you know, and I won't have you talk about her like that. Oh, you won't, won't you? What do you propose to do about it? I'll tell you what, nothing. Absolutely nothing. I thought you would have learned from your mistake in going against me, Julian. Your love for this woman has already cost you dearly. You're going to let it cost you everything? You, know, you can threaten me all you like, Father, but I won't have you intimidate Eve. She's a good doctor and a good woman. <laughs> Surely you jest. Damn you. No. It's okay, Julian. You know, Alistair's never approved of me. He did whatever he had to do to keep us apart all those years ago. Julian's a fool. I was merely protecting him from himself. Oh, is that it? Is that what you were doing when you discovered that I was pregnant with Julian's child? Please, you would have done anything to get rid of me. Even making me believe that my baby was dead. I'm not responsible for what you believed. Well, I did believe it. But guess what? Our baby is not dead. Our baby is alive. Eve, don't waste your time telling my father anything. Uh, don't bother trying to evade, Julian. I know you think your love child is alive, and I know all about your search for him. You know? Of course. And why do you both look so surprised? I know everything that goes on in my family. How? Never mind how. Just know that I'm aware of Julian's search for your son. I know about the baby picture you found. I know exactly what you're doing, Julian. Even more than you think. Did you really think you could keep this pathetic search for the child a secret from me? No one keeps secrets from me. I've been in on the search for your son from the beginning, but as usual, I'm about ten steps ahead of you. What do you mean, ten steps ahead of us? Uh, let me share a few things with you that you may not be aware of, Eve. First of all, you're absolutely right. Your son didn't die in the hospital. He was alive then, and he's alive now. We know that he's alive. But you don't know where he is. I do. You know where he is? Exactly where he is. You know. That's right. And I could produce him for you any time I wish. I could leave here now and come back with your son in tow. Don't get your hopes up, Eve. Alistair, if you know where our son is, oh God, please take us to him. I want us. I need to see him. I need to know that he's all right. If you know where he is, tell us. Let Eve have our son. She suffered so much. You just, you just tell us where he is. If you know where our son is, please take us to him. My father isn't about to do anything that might possibly make someone else happy. He's not going to take us to our son. Oh, but why not? I mean, what possible pleasure could you get out of keeping my son away from me, Alistair? I've thought about that baby and, and wondered about him and, and grieved over him every moment since he was born. My heart's been broken a thousand times over because of the way I lost him. You, uh, you really want to see your son, Eve? Oh, yes. 
Oh, yes, Alistair. I, I would give anything to see him. And you don't even have to take us to him. Just, just tell us where he is and we'll go to him. But what would you tell TC? How would you explain this mysterious baby to your husband? I'll just tell him the truth. He'll come around eventually. I just want my son. I've just lost so much time with him already. Please, just take me to my son. I... I could do that. Yes, I, uh... I could take you to him. <sighs> Thank you, Alistair. But I won't. Not now, not ever. I told you not to hope. The man has a hold where his heart should be. That's right, Julian. You do know me, don't you? I will never take you to your son, Eve. I've kept your bastard boy from you for over 20 years, and I'll keep him for another hundred if I have to. You will never see that child again. Ever. No! No! You never intended to let us find the boy, did you? Don't you love it when you can say, Gotcha! I do. God, how can you be so heartless? I'm your only son. To the best of my current knowledge, unfortunately, yes, you are. Oh, you can't be this much of a monster. Don't you have any feelings for your own grandsons? Who by no fault of his own never knew his mother or his father. You might as well think of him as dead, Eve, because you'll never find him. Never. How can you do this? What right do you have to keep us from I our child? I have every right. But he's Julian's son, your grandson! And that means absolutely nothing to me. God, you are a heartless monster. Perhaps. Unlike others, I'm not ruled by emotions. Look at yourself. Crawling on your hands and knees, begging, whining. Look at the level to which you've been reduced. I would gladly crawl and beg and whine if I could find my son. Oh, my God. If you would do this to your own son, then you would do it to your daughter as well. Did you think I'd go easier on Sheridan because she's female, the weaker sex? Oh, my God. Louis is right. Sheridan's in danger. You're doing something to hurt her. Something to ruin her relationship with Louise. Well, I'm not gonna let you do it. I'll kill you before I let you do what you're doing to Sheridan. Eve, no, it'll only make things worse. <laughs> but Julian, our son, he knows where our son is, and he's doing something terrible to Sheridan. You're evil. Alistair Crane, you are evil! <laughs> you don't know how evil I am, Eve. But believe me, when I'm through with you, you will. Ha 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 ha